Hi, this is Mandy with Scott Leroy Marketing. I want to show you how to download and log in to your Command Mobile app. Depending on what device you are on, the next couple of screens may look a little different. I just want you to get to your app store. So if you're like me on an Apple device, you will go to your app store. If you're on an Android, it may be Google Play or something similar. So I'll just go ahead and get to my app store here, top left icon blue square if you're on an Apple device and now I'm in my app store the search screen is on the bottom right that little magnifying glass so just make sure that's selected and begin typing in the name of the app now you can simply type in command and that should bring up the app you could also type in KW command or command mobile any of those options should work just tap search when you're ready and we can see the second app suggested is our KW Command app. It has a red square and a white background to indicate that this is the Agents Command mobile app where you sign in with your agent logins. To the right of that, you should see a blue icon of some type. Now, if you've never downloaded this app, it should say Get, G-E-T. If you have the app already downloaded on your device somewhere, it may say open. For us, we have downloaded this app before and removed it. So you see the blue cloud with the downward arrow indicating that I can download this off of my cloud now as an option. Either way, go ahead and tap the blue icon to the right, whether it says get or download, it showed you the process of it downloading and now I have an open option. If you have an open option right here to the right, you can go ahead and tap that. It will take you straight into the app. I actually want to bring you back to my home screen so that you can see where the app downloaded. So I'm just going to swipe this off my screen and come back to my home screen. And you can see again, red square, white KW at the top of your screen. This is the Command mobile app. I wanted you to see it side by side with the KW Consumer Mobile app so that you can see the difference. The KW Consumer Mobile app is the one with the white background, red KW. It's the one consumers would log into. Today, I'm showing you the Command Mobile app and that is on your right, the red square with the white KW. Go ahead and tap the red square to open the Command Mobile app you will be prompted to sign in if this is your first time. You will use the username and password that you would when you sign in to command by going to agent.kw.com. This is also known as your KW systems logins that you may have been provided by us at Scott Leroy when we do your setup. And so username first, Go ahead and enter that. If you do not know what your username is, you can reach out to your local market center staff and they do have those in a system where they can get that for you. For your password, this is case sensitive. Where your username is not case sensitive, your password is, so be careful typing this in. I'm going to go ahead and use face ID for the sake of the video. There we go. And so once you have your password typed in, if for some reason it's not letting you sign in and you're getting a failed option, you can tap that eyeball over to the right and it will allow you to see what the password is. Go ahead and make sure you don't have any spaces before or after, especially if you're copying and pasting your password onto the screen. Sometimes a space is added before or after and that can actually cause your login to fail. Once you are here and you've got your username and your password there, you can go ahead and type sign or touch the sign in bar, the blue bar. If for some reason you do not know your password, you can always click forgot password just below that. I'm going to go ahead and tap the blue bar for sign in. It will ask possibly if you want to enable face ID, whatever prompts you get on your device there, again, are specific to your device. You may or may not have that come up on your screen and you can select what you would like if it did. The terms of service will populate for everyone. 
when you're signing in to the Command Mobile app for the first time after downloading it. So go ahead and read through these in as much detail as you prefer. But when you get to the bottom, just make sure to click the box, touch the box that says, I have read and acknowledged the terms of service and privacy policy. And then you can tap accept. This will bring you to your command dashboard. Again, you're seeing device specific pop-ups. Command would like to send you notifications. I'm going to choose to allow. And also for the warning for TCPA, go ahead and click OK after you have read that. Now that we have our device open, you can or our app open, you can see that I'm here at the command dashboard and can begin working on my business. If you have any questions at all about what you just saw, please feel free to reach out to us at support at scottleroymarketing.com and we'll be happy to help you. Thanks for watching.